Our other top story tonight, the Federal Reserve says it's prepared to cut its key interest rate from a 23-year high. We don't know yet when those rates could come or how much they would be, but it would make buying things like a home more affordable. Just three years ago, the 10-year Treasury yield averaged 1.45 percent, and mortgage rates were at 3.15 percent. A monthly payment on a $300,000 home after putting 20 percent down would have cost under $1,300. Compare that to today, where the Treasury yield sits at 3.86 percent. Mortgage rates followed suit, rising to 6.54 percent. That same home in 2021 now costs you almost $1,800 a month. And tonight, Harrison Belsanti shows us how these potential federal rate reserve cuts might impact home buyers and the real estate market. The Federal Reserve Chair's recent proposal to cut interest rates could bring significant changes to the housing market. If sellers want to get their home on the market, you know, once that hits, uh, be ready because you most likely will have multiple offers. Beth Nolting from Remax in Davenport says the housing market a few years ago was incredibly competitive. As we've seen in the previous years when the rates were in the twos and threes, houses selling in a day, multiple offers. As rates continue to fall, the housing market is likely to see increased activity. I think as interest rates come down, you'll probably see more home buyers enter the market and that will continue to increase as interest rates go down, uh, which will probably cause values to go up as well. Mortgage lender John Cornish also noted the financial benefits of the potential rate cuts. It's been a tough, tough couple of years uh, for people. Things are more expensive. We're seeing higher balances on credit cards. We're seeing less savings. Um, it's harder. So as interest rates come down, it's making housing more affordable. It's going to allow you to qualify for more home or the home that you are qualifying is going to be more affordable. In Davenport, Harrison Belsanti, WQAD News 8. And right now, many experts envision a three-quarter point cut in September, November, and December, though even steeper rate cuts are possible.